Hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel. This is Timlaya and Mom channel. So today guys, I want to show you all how you can make a very crunchy yet soft and delicious chin chin for you and your family. This one is like very, very friendly. Okay. The old, the young, even babies can eat it because it's very, very moist. Like it's crunchy, but then it melts in your mouth. Okay. So just follow step by step on how to make it so um in the bowl is my butter yeah i don't buy the sachet butter okay i go for this measured one like the one from the carton that in the stainless plate is my whisk eggs okay so in the other nylon is my uh, full cream milk then milk flavor some salts and um nutmeg okay in this white bag i have my sugar i just came back from the shop okay i haven't really like bring out everything from the nylon so they are still there so yeah i have my special mix though um this is just one of them okay i have different mix from for different reasons like if i'm making for industrial purpose like for sale i have a different mix for that but this one is especially for family especially for your yummy yummy uh, enjoyment okay so um yeah i'm just going to go proceed to the process like show you guys please pay attention the mistake so many people make on this channel is that they just go ahead and maybe skip some of the parts hoping to get all of the detail in the video most of the detail is actually on the voice so please don't skip any parts and listen to the voices okay listen to my gorgeous voice oh is my voice not nice enough okay guys so let's proceed in this video i'm just going to be making um okay i have a target of what i want to make and the measurements i use actually gave me what i wanted so uh, i'm sorry i'm not sharing uh, measurements on this this video okay chin chin is actually the only recipe i introduced to sell in this channel and so many people have patronized like they've bought the recipe so far since december i posted about chin chin so many people have patronized me they've bought the recipe and i'm really really grateful like i didn't even know you all would be this interested i've sold this recipe like to so many people and a lot of you have actually sent me pictures videos of work of your work like you showed me all you're doing i really appreciate it if you are not following up in my community post please do start following up because i'm going to be posting all of the good and nice pictures that people from this channel try let's say they try my recipe i'm going to be posting them posting their errors like um their correction and everything so please always follow my community post so um that's actually the quantity i want but i didn't add up to like three cups because that will that's what i'll be using for kneading okay i'll be adding it later on so whatever major you are using just make sure you remove from same measurements okay so you want to remove some flour from same measurement so you can use it for kneading later okay so um yeah this is me just going on trying to do things very fast okay because it's actually night i i did this video at night of course i work at night most of the time so let's go there okay I'm so G to my bro, I'm sorry. It's not money, don't call me. It's been a long way coming. You know, go make sense if you don't know the journey. I do, I promise, mommy. But man got no worries. Just like yesterday, Mama tell me, say, make a right. Anytime I fall, I go rise up. She said, no big look or statue. All this stuff I know. Anyhow we be, I can face my face. Can't run from me, no stopping me.
ah, my shoulder started out to me like uh, I've been doing a lot of work lately and it wasn't doing me any well. So I had to go down low. I had to go to the ground. You can see this is actually the tedious um, part of making change. Like leading. Hey God, I hate to lead. I hate. That's why I'm scared of meat pie. Just kind of pastry that takes kneading. Okay, I don't like kneading. But then there are machines that does these things. So, so guys, here is what you want. This is what you want your dough to look like. Like you can see the way I'm pulling it out. This is what you want. Okay, you don't need a stretchy dough. This is what changing dough should look like. Okay, before you need. So back on the work table, we just want to like. Um, need it some more like just a little to get everything well organized so now we are just going to start rolling out but then spread enough flour okay that's why i said don't mix all your flour don't use all of them just remove say two three because depend on the quantity you are making anyway just remove enough that we enable you to knead very well so you need that for kneading for when you want to cut just to like spread on your work table and all that so you can see me doing the other kneading and everything just to get everything well incorporated in there so for those of you that want to take this as a business i would advise that you don't go through this process like you don't go to daily kneading and all that it actually hurts your shoulder like you get so much body pain so what you need to do is to look for a bakery near you a bread bakery and maybe just give them some money they will charge you but not really much say a thousand one five depending on the quantity you are doing so you can just pay them to need for you so they even charge as low as 500 now because it will take time their machine will do the needing for you so i would prefer you do that other than needing every day i'm really scared of needing seriously it's not easy okay so that would be a good option so yeah i'm just um, cutting it bit by bit because i don't really like having a old table to roll out so i'm just cutting bits because i want to uh, roll out in bits okay so there is how it looks when you roll out you can see it's not breaking this is because you need very well and when you need very well you tend to have a lot of products like your chin chin comes out uh, much you get so you where the strength is is when you are needing you have to need very well you can see it's not breaking out it's not even like pulling anything so this is what you need so when it comes to like the layer you want you can actually go to however you prefer you can go thinner you can go like um thicker but then you want something that will be easy to fry and comes out crunchy so this is the size i go for i don't really know the size in measurements or however but you can see this is what i went for oh gee I'm my bro i'm sorry it's no money don't call me it's been a long way coming in you no know, go make sense if you don't know the journey I do, I promise, mommy But man got no worries Just like yesterday Mama tell me, say, make a wise up Anytime I fall, I go rise up She said, no big good look, i start you It's tough, I know Anyhow we be I got to face my fears, can't run from me No stopping me I no go stop, I no go sweat too. My light is never gonna die. Don't I go fire any devil, devil? My life is forever gonna shine. Before them don't know me for my area. Now I'm here to the guys. Cause I came back on my sun, come, come. My light is forever gonna shine. I'm so G to my bro, I'm sorry. It's no money, don't call me. It's been a long way coming. You know, go make sense if you don't know the journey. I do, I promise, mommy. But man got no worries. Just like yesterday, Mama tell me, say, make a right. Anytime I fall, I go rise up. She said, no big look, I start ya. All this stuff I know. Anyhow, we be. I can face my face, can't run from me, no stopping me. Oh. 
so back in the kitchen here is me i've already like done almost half of it in fact this is the last batch i was going to fry so that was the onions i added from the beginning and you can see the oil has already gone down like i was running out of oil but i was still going to manage it to finish up since this is the last batch okay so um you can see i'm just adding it um the chin chin you can see it's just coming out like on its own there's no flaw coating it this is one thing i want you all to see there's no flaw i didn't like sprinkle flour on it you don't need all of that just go ahead and fry and that's it okay so just go one thing another thing you don't want to do rather is to overcrowd your pots don't overcrowd it like put just enough depending on the quantity of your oil okay don't overcrowd your pots yeah please if you have watched up to this point and you still haven't subscribed to my channel please do me the love and click the subscribe button there's a bell beside it do click it so you know when we have a new video like share and comment thank you so much for watching thank you for always thank you for always coming back thank you to all of our new subscribers i see you all i really appreciate your love thank you so much oh gee the my bro i'm sorry it's not money don't call me it's been a long way coming in you know go make sense if you don't know the journey i do i promise mommy Bad man got no worries Just like yesterday Mama tell me say make a wise up Anytime I fall like a rise up She said no big good look or stature It's tough I know Anyhow we be